Hi guys, good morning. Welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. <laughs> Today is Vlogtober Day 2. It is about 7 in the morning. It's like 6 after. <laughs> I've been up since 5. Um, I did some reading and uh, YouTube watching. I'm watching some more YouTube right now. <laughs> There's Pamela. Ooh, my head's shaking. I just got done doing a workout. I'm sitting down and relaxing for a few minutes before I go take a shower. <laughs> but uh, I'm sitting here working on my Ocean of Love Wrap, and it's a free pattern by Button Nose Crochet. <laughs> I got to try to it out. It's gotten big. That's how big it is so far. It's really pretty. This is a Red Heart with Love Boysenberry, and it's really floppy. <laughs> I almost used up the whole first ball, but I've got another one sitting over waiting. So I want to make this real big. And uh, it's super easy. After you get to the fourth row of the pattern, it's the same row over and over again. You just increase. It's basically a like a star blanket, except it's smaller. It's like half of a star blanket. It's here. Five. I think there's five points on it. And it's just a wrap, kind of like a, you know, it's like a shawl. And uh, I'm really loving the color. It's such a pretty color. And it's just a pretty pattern. It's made with triple crochets. So it's big and like... I don't know, it's just pretty. <laughs> I'm using a, uh, a H hook. It's coming along good. I've been working on it a lot the last few days. I have some finished objects to show you guys in a few days. I'll do a No Kitchen episode. But I used up all of the um, jeans yarn except one little ball. Let me see if I can find it right here. Out of five um, full skeins of that, this is what I have left. <laughs> and I got three finished objects out of it. And this will be going into my scrap again which is in this tote <laughs> that I use as a table. It's where I keep all my scrap balls and my, my blanket. I got the window open. You can't see because it's bright, but it's super foggy. That's some fire seeds. <laughs> I was munching on those yesterday. But uh, it's really foggy and it's cool. It's, uh, I think it's, it's like in the 50s right now. It's gonna warm up too. I think our high today is like 62, which is awesome. <laughs> and uh, it's gonna feel nice today, I think. And I don't really have anything on the agenda today, major. Just regular house stuff, and I am planning on pulling out some fabric and starting cutting bags for uh, my next shop update, which I might actually update the shop next weekend with some drawstring bags because I got a ton of fabric and um, on hand already to make drawstring bags with. I don't have any batting or anything. I'd have to go shopping for that, so I'll probably just, the next update will be just drawstring bags. And then uh, after that, another big update with zipper bags and uh, tote bags and all that stuff. <laughs> But uh, I'll do that later, and I'm sure me and Jesse will end up outside at some point. Today is Friday, and it's Devin's Friday also. He's his last day of work. He's off Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and tomorrow, Saturday, the third, we're going to the pumpkin patch. It's gonna be a lot of fun, I think. <laughs> the uh, temperature's gonna be pretty good tomorrow. I think it's like 67 is the high so far. And my mom and stepdad are going, and then also my sister, her son, and my brother might go. My brother may not though, and uh, my sister's husband has to work though, so, but either way, it'll be fun, <laughs> and uh, we're going to get some pumpkins and have some fun at the pumpkin patch, and uh, they're not doing the hay rides this year because of COVID, that doesn't make any sense to me, <laughs> because everything else is open, and it's still going to be packed, there's still going to be a ton of people there, so, we're still going to be around a lot of people, but, um, it is what it is, I guess, yeah, so, I don't know. I'm just gonna. I'll catch up with you guys throughout the day, I'm sure, if I can remember to. <laughs> After a certain point yesterday, I forgot to film. <laughs> but that's okay. Uh, yeah. I guess that's everything for right now. I'm gonna hop off here and crochet some more while waiting for Jesse to wake up and catch up on some videos because I'm really far behind on my watch laters. I need to catch up because a lot of people are doing Vlogtober and I want to watch everybody. <laughs> and I usually watch uh, videos either on my laptop or on the TV while I'm crocheting or cleaning or cooking or sewing. <laughs> So I don't get to comment always. So what I do is I watch them. And then if there's something I specifically want to say, I will pause and use my phone to uh, comment. And if I don't get to comment then, and then I go back to all the videos I watched and leave little emojis. <laughs> just so that the people who made the videos know that I did watch them. Um, I just don't always have the time to actually comment because I'm usually busy. <laughs> but I do always try to leave at least emojis. And uh, sometimes I forget to do that. But yeah, right now I'm watching Pamela. Uh... She's doing a review for Hook, a Hook case or something like that. I haven't watched it yet. But, uh, yeah, I'm trying to catch up. So I will catch up with you guys at some point today. <laughs>
Hey guys, checking back in. I'm sitting here taking a break. I'm eating some of these Ritz toasted chips. They're crackers. <laughs> They're so good. Sorry for the onion ones. Mm. But I just got done cutting a bunch of outer prints. I haven't cut any liners yet. There's 20 something here. Still watching YouTube videos. I got some more fabric down there I wanna cut. And then I, after I get all of this cut, I'm gonna start cutting the lab, uh, liners, but that's probably not gonna be today. I'm actually probably gonna stop now because I'm kinda tired. I've been sitting here for like an hour or two. So I'm gonna eat some more of these crackers that are delicious. Look at them, they're delicious. And they're really salty and covered in the seasoning. It's really good. I'm gonna watch some more um, YouTube. And I'm probably going to go crochet and stuff. I don't know. <laughs> but uh, I just thought I'd check in real fast since it's been a little while since I talked to you last. <laughs> I was just getting stuff ready for dinner. I always like to lay out everything I'm going to need that I can beforehand. It's only, it's almost four, so it would be a little while before I cook. I guess even the stove. <laughs> but does anyone else do this? Do they just prepare completely? I got the thing here to drain the meat with. The ingredients for making chili. <laughs> Got my uh, spatula already, got my pot clean and ready. It's just ready and waiting for me to brown the meat. <laughs> Look at my hair. It curls when I take care of it the right way. <laughs> I have naturally wavy hair, but normally I'm too lazy to actually care for it as wavy hair. So it ends up being fluffy and straighter, but floofy. All right, hold on. <laughs> Jesse says he's hungry. But um, I was just cleaning the kitchen. I got the counters and clean, and I emptied the dishwasher and started reloading it with dirty dishes. <laughs> and um, I got my hair kind of tied back just to keep it out of my face. Getting dinner set up. Yeah, pretty much ready for time to go by. <laughs> I'm sitting in there crocheting. I'll show you what I'm working on in just a minute. Let me go in there and get Jesse a brownie. He wants a brownie. Okay. Got him his brownie. <laughs> so I'm sitting here. I'm watching some more Rain. Uh, it's a show that's on Netflix. <laughs> I've been slowly watching it. Um, I watch a few episodes a day, probably. Sometimes I don't get to watch any. <laughs> but I'm using one of the Premier Everyday Anti Peeling Bobbins. <laughs> this one's called Lime Green. This was gifted to me recently from Brittany. Ah, my foot's stuck on it. <laughs> At Wilmix. It's kind of falling apart. So I'm trying to, <laughs> I want to work with this. And plus, it's a new yarn I've never used before. I've used Premier Every Day, but not Anti-Peeling Every Day Bobbin. <laughs> so far, I like it. But I started a shawl pattern. I was, I spent a lot of time today looking for a pattern that would use up the majority of this yarn. Because I wanted to try to use all of it. And the pattern that I'm making is called Comfort's Home Wrap by Fiber Flux. It was a um, crochet along at some point. But this is how far I've gotten. <laughs> It's one of those that uh, it's like a boomerang. It's flat on one side and curves out on the other side. I'm using one of my new stitch markers I got recently. And um, yeah, so that's as far as I got. <laughs> I just sat here and I, I whipped this out and then I was like, man, I really need to go get the kitchen ready for dinner. So that when dinner time gets here, I'm not like flying around. <laughs> Chili comes together super quick so I can just start making that. I'll probably start it around seven um, and then it'll be done and hot by the time Devin gets at home. So, um, yeah, it's, it's just now, it's about, hey, one of yeah, it's about 15 to 4 right now, so, still got a while to wait, so I'm going to sit here and crochet, and then I need to get up and clean the living room a little bit, and God, I got some laundry I need to put away and stuff like that, Ooh. <laughs> it's always laundry, and then I will check up with you guys later, and if I don't, I'll see you in another video. Tomorrow, we are going to the pumpkin patch, so we'll for sure film that some of that there. It'll be a lot of fun, I hope. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and hop off here for right now, and I might see you guys later. I don't know. Thank you. 